Carmen Teresa Martinez. Leo Stevenson Brown. I like that I am very mature now because yesterday was my birthday and I just do like myself. I hate myself a lot, most of the time. I would say like, for example, the AP testing. I came out of there thinking, oh my God, I failed. Um, and everyone, I kept hearing a lot of people's voices saying like, oh my God, that was so easy. Yeah, the writing part was easiest. No, the multiple choice was easiest. And I was like, I failed the whole thing. My parents set a standard, like they um, say like, oh, you can't eat this, you can't eat that. You'll gain weight, you need to drink more water, which I do need that, but on certain things. Well, they shouldn't really care because it's not their life, and they can't control other people. Even though it's my life, and I know I should have, I shouldn't care, but I, I do. When I'm swimming, I look at others and think, oh, I wish I was that good, or I could be better. But then I keep thinking, I'm not fast enough, I need to get better. But then at the same time, I backtrack myself by eating a lot or not doing, not staying fit enough to achieve that. It sets a standard that you feel that you need to fill or accomplish. Um, sometimes I cry over math homework of how much homework I get or tests coming up, I think that I completely bombed it or that I didn't study enough. Well, you shouldn't feel bad because the, the world's not over. You have, in soccer, you have another game to play. And in math, you could just change it by listening and actually participating. Younger kids have an imagination to fill that place. They don't look at supermodels thinking, oh, I wish I looked like that. They just look at supermodels thinking, I look like that. I'm wearing lipstick all over my face. I'm wearing those heels, walking around the house, making lots of noise. Um, that's the good thing about little kids and their imaginations. Um, unlike us, we're growing into a reality that's totally different. And we're basically leaving our imagination behind because society thinks that's kind of childish. Stay strong and continue finding and exploring life because it can get better if you continue to try. At least you aren't a person in all like Antarctica suffering to the, from the cold. <laughs>